What's up everybody? On a test drive today, I took this thing out to see what it would do a long test drive pretty much. And then as I was riding around, I run into a couple of motorcycles that wanted to take off at a stoplight. Usually when I see that, I know that they, they like speed, they wanna do some stuff and probably were racing, but you know, actually these two guys, we're trying to race each other, but the sniper, which has blue wheels, as you saw it take off, he took off first, and then the Mio 125i, FI, I believe, it's a fuel-injected one, took off after him. So I didn't really know what was going on, and they caught me off guard. So after a while, I, I, I figured it out, and I took off, and, you know, as you can see, I blasted by the Mio, which those bikes are pretty quick from the stoplight anyway. And as you can see from the acceleration of the sniper 155 um it's quite fast actually that bike was modified it was modified and i didn't know to what extent so it took off so fast that it caught me off guard i let it go because uh my bike tops out only maybe 115 115 kilometers an hour because of the fact that it's geared and i'm gonna have to change the gear ratio later and he already probably hit 140 real quick near the end of the uh, road as you saw so after that, I decided to just follow him down the road and, you know, stalking him, waiting for him. And then finally, we went at it. And this is how our story begins today. There should be a law against people pulling out in front of bikes like this. If you if you people drive a car, please don't do this. This is the stupidest thing you could ever do. Okay, you could kill a biker real quick and probably injure yourself too. You gotta drive better than this, people. I know it's hard to believe that this old boy could do that to a modern motorcycle, just like I did. But if you don't believe how fast we were going, take a look at the flyby as soon as I hit my brakes. Y'all see that? That is another race.
Sadly, after I raced this bike, I pushed the bike to the limit and it caused smoke to come out of the pipe after a while. And well, there we go again. I'm gonna have to go and uh, get into the engine again for the fifth time probably and find out which components are broken. But it's okay, you know, at least we had some fun, right? So anyway, off to the next video and thank, thank you guys for watching it and enjoying it. And hopefully you'll join us in the next video. BBG out. So guys, we got a little bit of a smoking issue.